which caused that enormous explosion. It measured 2.4 on the Richter scale and it was heard and seen for miles. Today, though, it was five companies who felt the full force of what they had done. You really must move away now! It's no surprise that people of Hemel Hempstead will never forget this. It was the no, biggest explosion that. ever Nothing. seen in peacetime Nothing. Europe, described by one man as like the end of the world. Now five companies have been ordered to pay fines and costs of almost £10 million for failing to make the Buntsfield oil depot safe, putting people at risk and polluting the environment. Incidents like the explosion at Buntsfield are exceptionally rare but they should not happen at all. Because when things go wrong in this sector, then the consequences are severe and can destroy lives, shatter local communities, and cause damage to the environment that can last for generations. So the industry should be in no doubt. We will always seek to prosecute those who put lives at risk and cause serious pollution. And lessons must be learned from this incident. 2,000 families were evacuated after the explosion. 170 are still fighting for compensation. At first blush, those are pretty big numbers, but what you have got to do is compare those figures with the fact that Total, in the first three months of this, year's, of this year, had profits of £2 billion. Now, these guys burn billions of petrodollars before you and I have breakfast. It's loose change. It's a disappointingly small fine. We were hoping for a record... Incredibly, no one died, but 43 people were injured. It was heard as far away as France and Belgium. But David Mitchell was much closer. His son's bedroom overlooks the depot. You know, the ceilings are collapsed and, you know, a bit to the roof are falling down. Today, he told us his thoughts on the verdicts. I thought it would be something like ten times that figure, something that would hurt them, obviously not destroy the company, but something that they'd actually feel. And I think they've probably gone away thinking we've got away with that. And I'm very disappointed. But Total, who face fines and costs of £6.2 million, have now been given permission to rebuild a new depot. Experts say we may never know the true impact that the Buntsfield explosion had on businesses, families and the environment. No one lost their lives that morning, but many certainly did lose their livelihoods.